Squarespace have been really, really busy with the updates recently. And one thing that they've definitely, definitely got right is the new way that we upload files. It's way cleaner, way easier to navigate. And for the majority of people, it's going to open up something that they didn't even realize that they could do on Squarespace. Uploading a file used to be pretty complicated for the most part on Squarespace. And I do have a tutorial on that, which has helped a ton of people. But with this update, I've had a few people comment saying it doesn't look like this anymore. And so I need to go through, I need to go through and update a ton of videos, but this one is quite an important one. So that's why I'm doing the update ASAP. This one should be nice and quick. And by the end of it, you should know how to upload a file on Squarespace. So let's hop in and upload our files. First off, what we need to do is go into edit. So you find whatever page you want to link to your file on and you add your link in. So I have a button here. You could add it to text. You could add it to an image, whatever you want. Double click. And then we're going to attach our link. We want to select file and then we can either select files from our current website, whether we've uploaded them prior or we can upload them now. So to do that, we just click this arrow and then we can click open and then what we need to do that's actually it's already selected but what we would have to do is just tick this click off and there we go you can see the file has been linked if you need to change this all you have to do is click edit and then you can choose another file like so click off hit save it's the same for text links image links whatever you click on the link edit the link go to file you can upload your file, select it, make sure it's opened up in new tab by default. There we go. Hit save. And it's as easy as that. You can also do the old way, which is going into website, clicking plus, clicking link, and then clicking file like so. You can then upload it just as we've done and then untoggling it and then hitting close. That way the file is still on the site. So a couple of ways you can do it. It's much easier than it used to be. So hopefully you found that useful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to build your Squarespace website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.